Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we got an unboxing of the Xbox Series X replica mini fridge. So I have a media room, picked this up over the holidays and decided to go ahead and do an unboxing of it real quick. I've heard mixed reviews about it, but overall still think it's pretty cool. As you can see with my setup right here, PS5, Xbox Series X, and a couple other things for my media room here. So definitely think it would be a good addition. Probably go ahead and throw it right on the side of this speaker here or somewhere behind these uh, recliner chairs. So let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the front of the box. So as you can see right here, it says this Xbox Series X replica mini fridge, thermoelectric cooler, and it's a one point five by one scale which is supposed to be a direct model of the xbox series x so i have both ps5 xbox one x series x so right here just let you know it's good for your gaming area portable perfect design car rv truck includes a usb port for charging and a 10 liter capacity so here's the front here is the side of the box. It says it holds up to 12 cans of soda and has a two snack shelf right here. Here is the back of the box. Pretty much the same thing, replica mini fridge. Pretty much that you know how you can set up the fridge to hold the cans. You don't have to keep it that way. You can put it by shelf and it also lights up here. So they let you know right here, here's the UPC. And let you know that Uconic.com is the maker of this and it let you know that what it features and the contents. Mini fridge comes with one AC power adapter, one DC 12 volt cable suitable for automotive use, two shelves, two door shelves. So, and the power options are AC and DC. And the features you can remove the shelves, have LED lights, USB port for charging, and it cools up to 36 degrees. So here's the QR code as well. So some of the complaints I've been hearing about this was that it makes a loud noise and it doesn't get everything real cold. Uh, but you guys got to keep in mind, it's just a mini fridge, so it's not going to cool just as much as a regular refrigerator but i agree for this price it could have been a little better but i'm gonna go ahead and like i said keep it anyway for myself and just do an unboxing for you guys and then i'll review it for about a month and give you hands on so let's look at the top of the box here okay it's the top have your styrofoam to protect it Okay, so we have our Xbox Series X instruction manual. Right here is the front. Here's the back again with that QR code so you can register it for whatever warranty. It looks like they have a, up to a one year warranty, I think. Here's the inside of it. Just that you know how you should hook it up. Do not touch with wet hands. Do not observe any objects in the cooler, which is should be self-explanatory, but again, always read your manual. Okay. So on to the, we have it in the protective plastic, as you can see right here. Here's the green, probably where the LED lights up at. Take this off. Nice poly bag. You see it's nothing else really pretty much in the box here um, assuming that the cables is probably on the bottom so let's go ahead and slide this mini fridge out okay so we was able to get that out the mini fridge out the box safe and sound so as we look at the front of the box here as you can see here's where I guess that lights up right there here's the bottom button just like the Xbox Series X and right here you have also another button there and there's your 
USB charger for your phone or whatever you need to charge up. So let's go ahead and open this up. So they stick the power cords on the inside of the mini fridge. See right here. Okay, so it looks like here's the one for the car charger or your portable power station. You can use this right here. And here are the two shelves they say they come with. Top shelf, middle shelf. Here's your snack shelves. Just instruction in pretty much every language of what not to do and what morning. Please, based on the ambient temperature surrounding your fridge, will be likely the condensation appears inside your fridge. So they're letting you know this is a normal and do not a defect. We simply ask you to wipe the condensation dry. So as it's cooling probably on the inside or maybe someone may be thinking it might be a leak, they're letting you know. So that's why I said read that instruction manual to definitely make sure that you guys read that. So, power cord right here. It's a pretty lengthy power cord as you can see. Here's the back to see which one it is. Right there's almost similar to the same one for the Xbox and the PS5. See, it's pretty lengthy, so no matter where you put it at, you can definitely stretch it out. Here's your important safety instructions. Right here, this is a portable appliance and it's provided polarized plug. So then you know, you still can get risk of shock here. So make sure you read that. Do not alter the plug. Okay, so let's take a look at the back of it. Nothing else right there. Pretty much see the inside. That's where the cooling, I guess it comes down and cools the cans or whatever you have in here. So let's take a look at the back of this. Okay, here's the side. Again, the top. Okay, so as we can see, it's switched to off and you have both of your cables here and you can see here's the one for the AC this up for you guys okay so we do have it plugged in here as you can see the light right here the Xbox light lights up and here is the green LED as they stated lights up as well and as we open it up no lights or anything in here I haven't pressed the on button yet I just wanted to see first follow the instructions where they say plug it up and turn it on Make sure it lights up. Now, let's go ahead and flip this switch in the back. So as you guys can see, it's just like a cooling fan for the Xbox. And I can definitely tell right away um, what people are saying about that noise. It's definitely a loud fan. But like I said, this will only be in the media room and if you have sound and movies and TV and whatever you're watching going, it should kind of hopefully drown out the sound. That's why I said I'd give you guys a review after a month to really see if this bothers me. But I, I don't think it will because this projector as well makes just about the same noise. So I'm okay with it. And these things are 
pretty much sold out. Can't find them, as you can see, it's a Target exclusive, but uh, I'm sure you can find it on some uh, secondary markets. So I'll put some links below for you guys to read it. Definitely subscribe to the channel. So, okay, let's get back to this. Put my hand in here and see how, if I feel any cooling right away. Not yet, but it's definitely um, starting to cool. If you guys can see that, I can feel it coming out. And for the amount of noise it's making, it should <laughs> cool this out. And it has that refrigerator smell when that have that smell as well. So I'll turn it around for you guys one more time. Okay, so here's the back. Switch it in the on position so the lights come on automatically whether it's on or off. Uh, you hit the on, it will start cooling the refrigerator. And if you see these right here, it's just replica marks. It's nothing just for the replica of the Series X. It's really nothing here. You push it, it's, it does nothing. So this is our replica at the bottom. And like I said, here's where want to plug it into your car summertime or out on your deck you can just plug it into a battery charger or whatever and the green light lets you know that it's on okay guys so I'm gonna do one more thing for you and then just wrap up the unboxing for this until it's time for a review and we filled it up with our Canada dry zero sugar and as you can see, it does fit the 12 in there as it has it on the box. So, again, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment below on what you think about the fridge so far if you have it. And I'll see you on the next video.